Alright guys, well it is a hot muggy midsummer day in late January here in uh, I guess this is paradise being in the mid 80s in, uh, on Thursday January 25th 2024 or something like that. So I'm heading off on my uh, latest Facebook marketplace ramblings around uh, so you know I anyone who has ever played the free pages on uh, marketplace or uh, or on Craigslist so these people brand new ad on this free nice looking charbroil propane grill works great free come get it I call them uh unbelievably the the thing is still there it's been up for six hours six hours and and, and, and was still there so i messaged the people and uh it's down in uh where i'm gonna be at this picking party later on and uh i said i'm i'm gonna be right there at uh you know right around dark i would love to come get this if you still have it and they and they messaged me back sure uh come get it uh blah 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 and they send me their address and all of this shit. and so we, we make plans for me to pick up this free grill which of course uh, meant i was gonna have to miss my uh sunset margarita on the dock and you know where this story is going. Ten fucking minutes later, they go, Sorry, uh, we have someone coming over to get that grill right now. And we weren't, sh we weren't sure we were going to see you at dark tonight. So we told them to come get it. And I sent them back the message, uh, Thank you for at least letting me know instead of fucking me uh, after I drive all the fucking way to pick up your fucking garbage. Uh, I didn't quite put it that way, but I think they could read between the lines. Uh, you know, I, I'm one of these weirdos. I, uh, I just gave away this uh, double bed mattress, which I had gotten off, off the free page. And, and I'm one of these crazy people who when i tell somebody they can come get it i stick to my word and if somebody calls five minutes later as they did i had eight people coming uh, fighting over this mattress and uh, i said well uh sorry but the, these people said that, you know, I told these other people they could have it. So if they don't come, uh, you're next in line. That's just the way I was raised. When I make a, 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 a deal with somebody, uh, I keep my word. I understand I am the last of a dying breed. And, and I, I, I'm not going to turn this into an anti uh grumpy old anti young person grumpy old boomer rant uh i don't know how old this fucking bitch was uh but anyway that's what i am up to today and uh oh shit it would have been nice if i had put in the directions to where i uh I am going. The first thing I want to do is uh, see if this woman has any pork chops today. She's got her sign out. All right. Fried ribs. Fried ribs. Oxtail. Never have been sure what oxtail is. Fried pork rinds, meatloaf, southern fried chicken, uh, 
fresh squeezed lemonade. I don't see, oh, fried pork chop right there. All right, so um, I'm just gonna wrap up. I'll just make this a very short rant and uh, come back with you. I wanna do a little bit of a PS on that rant that I did last night about whiny doomers uh, who act like they can't get out of debt. But uh, right now I have a fried pork chop with my name on it, and I don't want to talk with my mouth full. Angie B's Pollen Punch. Pollen Punch. That sounds pretty weird. Uh, maybe I'll have to get some Pollen Punch.